Dream Child 76, what areas will be safe from the Nemesis object in 2046? Guys, I cannot hammer it into you enough. Nothing in the outside world matters. Not even these cataclysmic resets and destructions. If you are doing what you're supposed to be doing and you are who you are supposed to be, you can, just by expectation, build for you an informed field that is so detailed that your outer reality will absolutely reflect that and create for you an island of protection and insulation even in the middle of the worst of the chaos. Quit worrying about the apocalypse. You're borrowing trouble. It's not necessary. It doesn't matter where in the world you are. Because that's who we are. We build our own realities all the time. You're like a little minnow. You're swimming through a river. You're swimming through a river. You cannot change the perimeters of the river. They're fixed. But you guys, you have great latitude to decide where you want to be, who you want to be, and when you want to be it. This is so quit, quit borrowing into the trouble. Quit worrying about which geographical areas are because they're all good. Or, if you're in one that's not, circumstances will be knit into your reality to remove you at the last moment. It says, it's who we are. It says, you, got, you can't... You talk, you're talking to a guy here that survived 26 years and takes his prison. You think all of them are my friends? Hell no. You don't think some of them guys wanted to kill me? Hell yeah. Especially when they found out after all this time I wasn't among them anymore. I'm about to be released on parole. That was the most dangerous time for me. Yeah. Some guys knowing they got life and they're never going to get out. But here I am, did 26. A 17-year-old kid, year old kid going in. Here I am, a 43-year-old man about to be released. You don't think they didn't want to get me? Yeah. Prison's full of negative default programming. It's full of demons. Hell yeah, but I didn't survive that because I'm a badass. I survived that because of who I am. Not, not the host of Archaics. I survived that because I'm Jason and I'm totally accepted the fact that I am an immortal and that I'm living through what's basically and essentially a fucking video game. That is my core belief because none of this matters. When I take this headset off, all I'm going to do is find out what my next avatar is and my next assignment. I'm either going to yay it or I'm going to nay it, if I have a choice. I don't know, but I know that nothing matters. Nothing. And that's why I am who I am. That's why I get on a 1,000-pound Harley and I speed and I go through these country roads like a bat out of hell and I don't wear a helmet. That's why. Because when it's time for me to go, I'm going to go. I'm absolutely fearless in that. And that fearlessness is 100% spiritual. It's not bravado at all. If the time comes when I'm to be knit out of existence, I'm ready for that too. There was a long time where I even battled, I even battled the idea of, of doing a YouTube channel. I was ready to check out. I was just ready to, hey, I had packed up all my research and I was ready to give it to somebody that I thought that would do what, do what needed to be done because my own life came with so many restrictions. So... I was on pro at the time. I'm not on pro. I'm free now. So I'm a. I don't know, man. It's just the 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 whole life and death deal. The whole the whole fear. Of, none of that stuff. I don't allow it to apply to me, so it doesn't on a daily day basis, man. I get up, man. I'm immortal. There isn't a single thing that's bad gonna happen to me that I, that that I didn't I didn't allow. It's just not going to, man. It's, and it's not. This isn't this isn't delusional. It, it's none of that. It comes by virtue of long experience. Simple, I mean, simply, you're trapped on a cell block with 200 men and about 60 of them don't like you. You're not going to survive. There's 365 days in a year. There's 1,095 days in just three years. I spent 9,545 days in prison and survived that. Not, not by any means other than the fact that I realized during that time that nothing matters, that I'm okay, and that nothing around here is going to affect me. And by maintaining that attitude, it was, it was knit into my informed field. My auric field on a daily basis emanated an energy that other men responded to. They didn't understand it. They didn't want to understand it. Being very spiritual isn't about 
tithing and going to church and, and, and doing good deeds all the time. It's not. Remember, I tell you guys often, act as if you are and you will be. Reality, reality will commiserate. If you are creating an informed field, the simulacrum will populate it. So that's, that's the best answer I can give for that. I'm, it, there's no, there is no safe place for you if you're not in the right state of mind. None. Period.